Hey parents, it's Laura. I've heard from a number of you that some pre-recorded options for parents would be preferable because live virtual gatherings over Zoom are just super hard right now with everything that's going on. And I totally understand that. I'm feeling the same way. Um, so I'm going to offer a video now and then with some encouragement and a prayer. And hopefully it's something that can lift your day and encourage you. So right now we are between the Jesus Ascension and the day of Pentecost. I've been thinking a lot about those two dates and why there's a gap. I've been wondering, um, you know, why didn't Jesus just send the Holy Spirit right away before he ascended? I don't know why he didn't just wait till Pentecost and then the Holy Spirit was going to descend. I don't understand. Um, so if you look at Acts 1, 3 through 11, you see the story of Jesus' ascension. And it says, then 10 days later, the disciples were all gathered together. They were um, praying together. And in the meantime, in the in-between time, they'd picked a new disciple to replace Judas. They had been gathering for prayer. They were doing all sorts of things that are kind of surprising to me because I think if I were them, I would have been freaking out. I would have been like, why did Jesus leave? Why are we alone? Yeah, we have each other, but where is our guidance from God right now? It would, be, it would have totally freaked me out. And I feel like right now we are all in that sort of time period right now. We're in this waiting period where we are in between closing down and opening up and we don't really have any firm dates for opening up uh, and we have an idea of when things are going to open but we don't know exactly when and we don't know exactly what's going to happen I mean who knows what's going to happen in some sense and we're in this period of waiting which is painful and so I just wanted to um, help us all acknowledge that because that waiting is hard on its own but then on top of that we are working at home or homeschooling in a way we've never homeschooled before or doing online schooling. Also, um, we are just, we're with our families 24 seven in a way that most of us have never been. And it's hard. It's made me have to look inside and, and ask myself, what kind of a mother am I? What kind of a wife am I? What kind of a human am I? What kind of a church employee am I? Um, and so it's been a lot of, uh, introspection. Um, which is painful, but necessary. And I, I hope that it's been beneficial for you in some way too, that you've been able to see in all of the difficulties, some good come to the, t the surface. Um, and so I wanted to just uh, acknowledge that we're in this in-between time and that say, you know, I'm right there with you. And uh, I also wanted to share a mindfulness technique that I shared in my parent email last week. Um, and you can use it with your kids. You can use it just by yourself. I have been using it a little bit with Joseph, but mostly I've been using it for myself because my anxiety has been through the roof. So it's just called cooling the pizza. And it's kind of, you know, it's a silly idea, but it's just a breathing technique. It's been really helpful for me. So you imagine that there's a hot steaming slice of pizza in front of you and it smells delicious. And so you breathe in. And then you exhale to cool the pizza. And you cool the pizza as many times as you need to before you start to kind of relax and your heart rate slows down a little bit and you can calm down. Um, so I've been cooling the pizza a lot these days. And I just wanted to share that with you. And yeah, I just share that I also miss you guys. I miss seeing all you parents. And um, I love that we were really getting to know each other. And I, I hope and pray that that can continue uh, through this time. So uh, I'll offer a prayer for us because parenting is, it's on another level right now. I'll tell you that. So um, I'll, I'll pray for us. Lord Jesus, we cry out to you and we ask for your help because we are waiting in this difficult time and we're waiting here with our families, our kids, our spouses, our pets. We are trying to do everything all at once, all together in the same house. And God, it's so hard. We pray for your help. We're in this waiting time and we remember when your Holy Spirit came long ago and we just pray that he will come powerfully now in our lives. Help us remember that you're always with us and guide us through this time, this time of waiting and not knowing when or what or why or who. <laughs> we pray for your help, God. Amen. So love you all. Miss you all. Um, share your prayer requests with me if you have any. And um, even if you don't share any, I'm praying for all of you. Bye, guys.